don't stop believing. Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Margaret and welcome to my channel, Texas Gal Treasures. And this evening we are going to do a thrift with me. And you may notice that I'm not in a thrift store right now. But what I have is footage from when my kids and I stopped off in a little thrift store like a privately like church run one in Marble Falls. We were on our way to my sister's place. This was a number of months ago, um, but I just never got a chance to edit it and put it up. And so I wanted to come on and share it with you. Another reason is that it was before I really started picking up a lot of like hard goods again mugs and things. So it's kind of fun to look back at it and cringe at myself for not picking up certain things um, or even looking at them because I was just in that beginning stages of moving out of only picking up jewelry and really small things. But I did pick up some things and I do see other things that I wish I had picked up now. But what are you going to do? You can't uh, go back and can't go back. If I could turn back time. No, it's not worth it. It's okay. I got other stuff. I got a room full of stuff. <laughs> what am I talking about? But anyway, I wanted to welcome you here. Hopefully this is not too loud because it's loud in my ears. Let me turn that down um, <clears throat> and say hello. If you're new here, my name is Margaret and I support my family by one of the ways is by flipping things I find at garage sales and estate sales on eBay and Etsy. And this is what I do. So I do have a teeny bit of housekeeping before we get started. Um, and this, let me show you, this will be the format over here so you can kind of see how it's going to go look and I, I'm trying to do something with the chat I don't know if that's going to work or if it's going to be super frustrating let me get it to the bottom where is it well okay forget it uh, no I can't forget it okay this is not the housekeeping I was talking about but I'm just going to put it there like that okay so <clears throat> as many of you or you may know I started doing and I haven't done a separate video maybe I should do a separate video for this but I've been getting a lot of requests for I've started doing like um, individual just a help, like, help session like for an hour and I have a link down below for it <clears throat> but some of the questions I've been getting are do I only have those times available because I have a a calendar thing where you can sign up and you just choose your time and it messages me so it makes it a lot easier but if none of those times work for you if that's if you're interested in that then just send me a message say hey really want to do this I'll sign up you know fill out the thing to let you know what I want to work on or look at or whatever and um then we can get together privately message and figure out a day and time I just put times there that I knew I could do it so <clears throat> pardon me again so there's that, and um, the link is down below if you're interested. If um, anything from like how to research things, how to get started on print on demand, or do print on demand stuff, or whatever, just you know, some people need a little extra, a little extra help. And I'm, I, I mentioned it in one of my other videos that like, oh, I get a lot of messages and emails, but I can't, I feel bad ignoring people. So this is my way of being able to say, okay, I can do this, but it's, I can't, it's too much. I can't respond in email form, message form. So, okay, there's that. That's out of the way. So let's get started. All right, so what the, what I'm going to do here is I've got this video footage, and what I'll do is play it, and we'll look at it together and kind of see. This is the only time I've been in this thrift store, so I, I kind of want to go back. Whenever I go to my sister's, we drive through Marble Falls, and sometimes it's open, sometimes it's not. I have to get the the days and times and all that worked out, but I can't revolve my trips to my sisters around thrifting now, can I? Or can I? All right, so I'm going to push play, and then we'll just pause it along the way as we see things, okay? And I'm trying to see if, let me know if you can hear the, the video when I push play. I can hear it. I hear music too. Let's see, I see, oh, that little, here, I can pause it there. That little glass box um, that has like a little lid, I think there's a lid on it, or maybe it used to have a lid on it. That's right there. I don't think you can see my cursor. Um, that would have been kind of cool to pick up. And then a little while we come back and one of my kids looks at the, the jewelry box. So I like vintage jewelry boxes. The prices here were pretty good. Some things were kind of expensive, but all right, let's take a look up here. Oh, back scratcher. Look what I found my Michael. <laughs> Okay, it's a little. Yeah, we're oh, going around. You want it? Put little things in it. What do you do? Here's what I. You can hear. It. Okay, good. Um, my kids. I'm sure some of you probably have this happen too, with where your spouses or your kids bring you stuff. We're like, what about this? And it's like, no. 
oh no, you know, but I don't want to be mean and say no. <laughs> so I, I'm still working on that. So, okay, let's keep going. Shout out in the chat if you see something that you're like, oh my gosh, grab that. You should have grabbed that. So, so far, a mm, couple things. This was a set. It was like a bathroom set, but I wasn't sure if it was worth picking up or not. Let's see. So that was two bucks. We didn't end up getting it, but it might have been worth picking up, you know, vintage uh, jewelry box. Do you guys want to look it up? I buy sell sparkle says yes my daughter is eight or nine and bring, she brings me everything okay let's look at let's look up things too as we go because I have this set up as well so let's look up in case you never even look at vintage jewelry boxes uh, let's look at that vintage jewelry box so you can kind of see what those yeah sometimes my mine do well with that as well <clears throat> okay so I'm looking at these vintage jewelry boxes they're not so like here's a white one that's kind of like that same style, five dollars and forty cents. That is, let's look at sold. That's got an auction. Uh, ah, yeah, another big, uh, Texas gal. Okay, so I'm looking over here just to kind of see. Look at this, this vintage wooden. I see these wooden ones like this all the time. I never pick them up because I think they're not cool. But maybe I don't need to look at them because look, that one's over thirty dollars. Maybe it's a fluke. I'm looking to see if there's one of those, what should I say, like felt lined? Because I'm not seeing it. Velvet lined, that might pull up a bunch of stuff. What do you think? What else could I put in there? I put vintage jewelry box. Well, that encompasses a lot, doesn't it? Oh, good heavens. Look, that one's 40 bucks. I, do you guys see these all the time? These like wooden ones like that? And I always think, meh, meh. But maybe I need to look at them again. All right, now just getting silly. I thought for sure I would see these. Um, oh yeah, Patricia, Secret Santa. Let's see, let's see, vintage. Oh, what, what else can I put? Lid, velvet. See, and if it doesn't pull up in a second, we'll move on. But they, I mean, I've sold them before, and I have one over here that I plan on using to take pictures with. Okay, I give up. <laughs> I don't want to spend the whole time trying to find it. Um, but yeah, I have one. It was right there. I just cleaned up. But now I moved it. Um, that I was planning on using to take pictures of jewelry lots and things like that. So let's move that back one more time. There's my chat. Okay. There we go. Okay. So let's move on with the video. And if you like this format, I know it's a little clunky right now because I'm just getting it going, but go give me a thumbs up because it's fun. All right, let's move on. So do you guys sell porcelain? Do you guys pick up porcelain stuff? That can do pretty well too, depending on what it is. I see some little demi tasse cups over there that I walk by. Again, I'm like, dang, I didn't even look. That's for thread. Thread on. Those are thread holders. Let's see. If you see something, say something in the chat. If you see something, say something. But I think that's. So tell me what you think about this little schoolhouse. It was four bucks. I didn't end up getting it. It's a Fisher Price, obviously. I think I only got one other thing, but I'll. Maybe two things. I'll show you in a minute. Would you have picked this up? It looked kind of banged up. But I didn't even bother, because as I've said very a number of times, that I just was just getting started picking up other things. So let's look up this Fisher Price schoolhouse. Fisher Price. Please don't make me kick myself. But I will. I'll do it. Fisher Price. Is this it? That's it. Okay, let's look at sold. Oh, these are sold. Okay, I don't feel too bad. Because I don't think it had any of the the stuff with it. I'm clicking the wrong one. Hang on. Bringing it up, I think. Nope, that's the wrong thing. I'm going to get it. What is the matter with this thing? <sighs> I'm... <laughs> I swear, I don't know what I'm doing today. Oh, do you ever have one of those days? Okay, so here's this. It doesn't have the all the pieces and stuff, so... I don't think we would have really gotten that much for it. 
So like that one was nineteen ninety nine, but it had the all the schoolhouse pieces that went with it. This one had all the stuff, so twelve dollars. So I don't like here's one just like that that was that sold for ten bucks, even on auction. But yeah, gosh, I remember all this stuff. So I think I did okay skipping it, right? So that's fine. It's good. <laughs> Now let's see if I can magically get this thing back. Okay, uh, let's see in the chat plushies. I would have been in that bin. I buy sell sparkle says yes. Um, yeah, I didn't again. Like, oh, why didn't I look? Because I yeah, I started picking up plush again too. Let's see. Celeste says I would not have gotten that because I don't think it would have been viable to ship it a real yeah real shipping cost. Yeah, it, baby, they can dance like a man. It's gonna be one of those shows, I guess. Uh, would a musical jewelry chest is always a great gift. This is true. I take that back. I see people pay 26. Oh yeah. People will pay if they're, if it's what they want. Hi, hi everybody. Okay. So I'm glad I didn't get that because it was four bucks. I did. Okay. Phew. Good job, Margaret. Skip it. Let's keep going. A helmet like that. No, because it could have, like, um, bugs in it, you know? <laughs> he wanted to put on a helmet that he found. It's like, mm -mm, no. Negatory, good buddy. Games. I'm looking at the games. Helmets. What else? Do you guys pick up kids' clothes? I don't really. I liked this thrift store. I like. It was so... Oh, here we go. Y'all, wait a minute. So my, as you can tell, my guy here, he loves, loves penguins. And so he spies this penguin way up high on the shelf. And this penguin comes home with us. And I do want to look him up because I'm interested in, in what he would sell for. But, um, but we're not selling him because he's brought us so much joy. So look this, and I, now I'm like, ah, there's a whole back wall was all Christmas stuff, like holiday stuff. And I didn't even really... I kind of glanced over it, but I didn't um, really look into it very much. But let's look at one. Let's look and see what's there. And then let's take a peek at this penguin that might hang on. A window popped up and I can't get it to close. Please close. Um, okay, here we go. Ready? A penguin. See if it works. You want to try to turn it on? That looks like it dances. Okay, so looking at all this stuff, this Christmas stuff. Hang on, this there's a pop-up window that <laughs> this is just gonna make me cry. Oh my gosh, I've got this pop-up window that won't close, and it's right in front of my whole screen. Do you know how to do this? It's trying to make me update stuff, and I'm not ready to update stuff right now. And even when I try to lower it down where I can't see it, it keeps popping back up. Oh my gosh. All right. I'm just going to try to cover it with other windows. <laughs> there. Okay. So let's see if I missed anything here. All right. So yeah, Christmassy stuff. Y'all, I feel so out of whack right now. Did it turn on? Okay. Here's the penguin. Right. I'll just let y'all watch this. Huh? Yeah. Try it. Here we go. It's not working. What? <laughs> <laughs> Uh huh, for real, y'all. Uh huh. So, this penguin, it doesn't just sing and dance, it has like butt cheeks that bounce in time to the music. And it's, it's just, it's tacky and hilarious and everything all at once. So, let's see if what, if you had one of these, what might you be able to sell it for? I know. Oh my gosh, this pop-up window. I, I, I've never had anything experience. I've never experienced anything like this. It won't, like I'm clicking on the little red X on it and what, you can't see it, thank goodness, but I can't get rid of it. And I'm trying to find my eBay window and I'm worried that it took over where my eBay window was. No, there it is, okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's look up <laughs> Penguin. Yes, he's twerking. So let's look up a twerking Penguin. Um, at least 15 bucks. Y'all, and because they considered him plush, he was 50 cents. He was 50 cents because they sell their plush 50 cents. And now that I know that, I'm like, I do want to go back and look at their plush. What would you call that? Uh, twerking penguin 
Christmas. Let's say Chris. And it took us forever to figure out what he was singing, too. Um, so oh, look at this. There he is. 28 bucks. Do any of them have a video with this guy twerking is what I want to know. Oh, these are sold. Look, that guy sold. Well, he still has the tags. 20 bucks, 28 bucks. Oh, my gosh. I want to see if anybody put a video in there because they totally should have. Nope, they didn't. Um, wow. I don't think my kids might lose their mind if I sold it, though. Um, those were at Walmart last Christmas. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, come on. That, I don't, I don't know if I could get them to sell it for $28. Does it bring me more than $28 worth of joy? This is what I need to know. Um, okay, let me bring this window back up. Please, please work. <laughs> I'm trying to get the right window to pop up for you guys. Oh my gosh. Uh, no. Yes. But now I've lost this one. Mm -mm -mm. There we go. Okay, here we go. So let's see. <laughs> so what they did, what they ended up doing was when we, because we were on our way to my sister's house, we they they snuck up to her front door and put it on the front door and kind of hid behind the you know knocked on the door and then whenever they were coming to open the door they punched the little button so it started dancing and they went and hid so when when they opened the door there's this like twerking penguin on their front porch <laughs> anyway <laughs> now you're just watching us laugh <laughs> Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. <laughs> so let's get back to the actual <laughs> thrifting <laughs> and the, instead of the penguin. And by the way, if you're wondering what it says, it sings, Christmas is my favorite time of the year. That's what it's saying. And it took us a long time to figure that out. All right. Let me know if you see anything. And now I'm like, oh, I would have gotten that. Look, I would have gotten those. Let me go back. The, right behind that Santa that I picked up, there are these little um, kind of like ceramic luminaries. <laughs> ah, darn it. Okay, let me try this again. You'll have to hear me laughing again and again. I would have gotten those ceramic luminaries. I think they said they were 50 cents. Yeah, on those. But I didn't get those. <laughs> Look, there's some really cute ornaments. There, and then back here, you see that white Christmas tree that's got like the star cutouts. That probably would have sold, you know, because you can poke either poke the lights through it or have the light inside it. I didn't pick that up to look at. Um, tell me if you see anything else that you would have picked up. <laughs> Let's see. Now I'm going kind of fast. Oh, I'll have to ask them how much it is. <laughs> Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. It says, uh, let's, it's about to get real. Man, I couldn't get this at Big Lots in January. Clears for four bucks. Totally. But now we know, right? Oh, look at that divided tray down there. That would have been cute too. After Christmas sales. Totally. I mean, and people, I think the penguin thing was part of it too, because it's a penguin. My, my guy, you know, he loves penguins. So, okay, keep it on. <laughs> Uh, this is my stellar camera work right here. Normally, I edit all that out. Here's the floor. Here's the floor. Who was like, I have the best idea. We're going to make a penguin with a big booty. We're going to sing a weird song. First, I thought it was just a knuckly penguin. But whenever I saw the G, it started singing. Let's while we're at it, why don't we look? Hang on, let me get see if I get. Let, let's look and see if the other twerking ones, because we were at Home Depot, and I saw that Home Depot had some of those twerking um, animal, or it was like Santas or something. Oh gosh, here I go again. I did the wrong one. Is it this one? There it is. So let's just look, um, twerking, twerking, there's a Santa that fills in. Look, twerking Santa. Let's see what, what pops up there. Uh, gosh. Do those sell as well? Let's look at the, are these sold? Let's look at sold. 
I bet there's other ones too. Look at Santa. This somebody sold this Santa for forty nine ninety nine. Twerking Santa. Okay, others twenty five. Some of these are really busy there, but hey, yeah, whatever. <laughs> they drew an arrow on just in case you couldn't figure out like what twerking was. It means he's gonna shake his bottom. <laughs> Um, so, yes, yeah, some of the Santas are did, did better. So, let's see. Twerking. Yeah, so next year, like once they go on sale this year, then go get some if you can still find them. Let's just do twer twerking Christmas. That way maybe it'll fill in other, not just Santa, but other things. Like here's a bear, 1629. So if you get them after the fact, after Christmas, for a couple bucks... Look at that Dalmatian dog. Oh my gosh. $20 on that one. I'm just going to scroll through Santa. So, oh, there's a reindeer one. Or is he a bear? He's a bear. Never mind. Christmas tree. Snowman, $24.99. Look at twerking llama. Look, see video. Good job. Good job. $42.99. That was free shipping though. Still. Okay, I think we get the idea. Look at the bear. These bears are selling that one sold for 20 but these other ones were like 50 bucks 60 bucks bring it okay that's yeah so keep an eye out this year when you're at um the after christmas sales if you see any of these snap them up because we went crazy for this penguin i tell you what totally totally okay let's watch some more what do you say i think that white christmas tree made me sing uh, uh, Celeste is saying, the white Christmas tree makes me think of the trees we painted in elementary school. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. It was totally worth the experience. Um, oh, that's him talking. He's laughing and talking. Okay. So now I pause it here because I wish I had looked at that pear. Do you see that pear shaped dish? I didn't look at that. I wish I'd looked at that. Let's see. Mmm. So, I'll come back to that in just a second. What was I about to say? Oh, anyway, well, let's just move on. It's, the, the moment has passed. All right, so yeah, I wish I had picked up that. Let me see if there's anything else you see that I should have looked at. It was kind of tight. Here we go. You may or may not have seen those in another video. I did a whole video sharing those. I do end up getting all of those. I think there were six or eight of those. Um, and these are escargot ceramic, like cook, you cook the escargot in them. You put them in there and you uh, bake them in the oven. Um, and those are selling for pretty good money. So I have mine listed as a lot, but I guess I should probably pull that up because that's what we're here for, right? Instead of just saying. So let's see. Did I cover myself up again? No, okay. Um, escargot dish, right? And th these ones were made in France. Made in France. Escargot dish. So you can kind of see. Oh, mine are ceramic. I guess I should put that in there. Ceramic. Let me take out made in France. Ceramic escargot dish. So these ones. Oh, this is sold for six ninety nine. But these four sold for thirty bucks. These two for fourteen. This big one, somebody took a, an offer on. And so you can see some of the prices were a little bit lower, but some like these sold for 30 about 27 So, yeah, when I saw those, here's the ones like I have. that These three set, sold for 20 I don't remember what I have mine listed for. Let me go look. Oh, never mind. I'm like, can I pull my shop up without like going behind the scenes? Maybe I can. Let me try it. I'm going to pull it up. Just for you, because I can't remember what I listed mine at. I have a sale going right now, so maybe it'll show. Oh my gosh, why did I do this? Now it's taking forever to load. <laughs> there we go. Okay, now I can pop it back over. So, let's see. Housewares probably is where I stuck it. And there they are. So yeah, I have mine listed for 60 bucks. So we'll see. And they're on Etsy, too, so I have them cross-posted on Etsy. So, very cool. All right. Now, let's get back to the video. Very soft. <laughs> 
This is me looking at him. Eh, move. There's some more. It's in poop. <laughs> it's moss. It's not poop. Oh, I turned... There was music in the background, so I turned the volume down because YouTube will tag you if you have music that they recognize. Copyright. Copyright. There's a little... Right behind that little monkey that he was looking at, orangutan or whatever, in the cage, that brass... It's either a letter holder or a napkin holder. That's something else I probably would have picked up. Um, because it's really cool, vintage, kind of, kind of an Art Nouveau look. You can barely see it. Look at, I can, I'm trying to get where you can see it. It's that metal brass looking thing right behind his hand where the monkey is. So that's something I probably would have picked up too. Let me pop my search up so you can see why or what we could have asked for that. I'm guessing, depending on the site that I sold it on, um, maybe 20 or so. Brass Art Nouveau napkin holder. Let's look. So, well, that's an 18 bucks right there. So, look. Yeah, I probably would have been closer to the, the higher end on that. So, yeah, I would have picked it up for... Because it's kind of similar. It's not exactly the same as this. Where is it? But I would have... Yeah. Anyway, that's something I would have picked up. Let's see. Is it like that one? What if, what, if, what if that would have been the same one? How about that? Okay, let's see if I can get this back down. There. Uh, it's not exactly the same, but similar. Similar style, right? Is the chat frozen? Am I frozen? Can y'all see me? Oh, gosh. Where's my... Let's see what I got over here. There we go. No? Okay. All right, so let's keep looking. And the volume's down again. Look at this. Oh my gosh, isn't this gorgeous? I really, 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 really love this. Um, I think it's uranium glass. It's that green. The uranium glass is the one that will glow under a black light because it's got uranium in it. <laughs> Obviously. Anyway, it's either uranium glass or something very close to it. It's, that, it's in that same style, but oh my gosh, $20. I wanted it for me. <laughs> But then look behind it. There's one of those little plant squirters psh, 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 kind of deals. That would have been cool. I need to go back to this thrift store. Um, oh, good. Thank you, Cindy. I was like, I don't see anything happening in the chat. Maybe we're just watching. Oh, but isn't it gorgeous? I love it. I love that green. Okay, what else do we see? There was so much stuff that now I wish I'd really, really looked at. Glass stuff. I don't really do a whole lot with just like clear glassware. What am I looking at? I must be... I don't know. Nothing down there. Ice tea maker, anyone? Nope. Bread maker. I'm just swinging back and forth. Oh, good heavens. All right, so my kid, this is where my kid's like, oh, what about this? There's a Harley mug there. I don't think I pick it up either, but it's got all those flames and stuff. That would have been kind of cool. Maybe I, no. Bye. Bye, mug. <laughs> those pedestal ones with the blue bonnets on it, those would have been nice. Just just dreaming. Maybe someday we'll come back. And then over here, there's more mugs. Oh, I clicked the wrong thing. There's a Starbucks mug. I didn't see the base of it, I don't think. So I'm not sure what um, year. So searching for it might be kind of hard. And oh, I have zero idea. College Debt is asking when is eBay getting rid of PayPal? I don't know. Are they? I haven't paid attention to that. Is that bad? <laughs> So that's a cute little, I mean, six bucks on that little teacup would have been kind of outrageous, but um, there's a trivet. Gosh, my camera work is just amazing. I don't know why the Oscars haven't called yet. Best video in the YouTube category goes to, not Margaret. There's the back scratcher, just in case you forgot I had it. <laughs> Um, I know some people like to sell those wicker or woven like basket, uh, what do you call them? They're for like a picnic, right? You would put the, uh, you would put your paper plate right on that. So let's look at those up because I know I've had people say that they, one second. Hmm. Um, hey. 
like to sell those. I don't know if they still sell. Maybe it was a while back, but let's find out what we can. Oh, here we go again. You guys, maybe I should do my videos in the morning when I'm fresh, not in the evenings. Yeah, favorite plate holders. I got it. <laughs> Best videographer, right? Okay, so let's look that up. Maybe I should try doing that. I don't know. Would y'all watch in the morning? Most of y'all are watching at night, so I don't know if that would be a problem. But we'll see. We'll see. Okay, so bask. Oh, what do you call it? Woven paper plate holder, right? So, oh, look, I guess they do sell. Okay. Are these sold? No, these aren't sold. Here we go. Let's look at the actual sold items. Um, so, okay, that's not that bad. I guess they do sell. I mean, if you got them cheap enough, let's say I got a six of them for a dollar at a garage sale or something like that and sold six of them for 12, that, that's pretty good. I mean, it's not like insane money but that's i mean shoot set of 10 for 20 bucks okay they do still sell good to know i'm just thinking who uses these do you use these like i've never been to a picnic or a party or anything where they're like if you're gonna get a paper plate you better make it fancy and put it on the tray the paper plate holder Maybe it reinforces the paper plate. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so, um, all right. So let's, oh, oops, wrong one. Let's move out of this. Let's move it on out. Yep. Okay. So that's something else maybe I should have picked up. So let's see. Okay. I've got some stuff in the chat. <laughs> Not in the morning. Erin says, yeah, I'm like, I, I think about it. I mean, I guess I, if I'm doing just to put it up, I, I don't know if you'd be able to catch me live. But man, every day for breakfast, how about that? Okay. I mean, I guess if you like that, you like that. What are you going to do, right? So, yeah. Hello. I'm so glad. I'm trying to get the thing where it won't flatten out your chat stuff. There we go. Okay. All right. Let's keep going. So, paper plate holders. Check. Now we know. The more you know, the more you sell, right? We'll just make up a new line. How about that? <laughs> we'll try to make it work. It's not fetch or anything, but, you know, whatever. So, in here, this is Quan Yin, I think, um, Goddess of Compassion. There's that micro, I mean, that videography again. I was looking at that radio clock to see if it had the flip over. Some of those can still sell. Gosh, I just didn't even edit this very well, did I? There were some nice pieces of porcelain in there, and I feel like I was... Maybe I just haven't looked at it yet. I feel like I saw some hat pin holders, but I didn't pick them up either. Look at all these books I'm not looking at. Look at, at oh gosh, you guys. I almost just want to not even show this to you because <laughs> it's a mess. So, yeah. Just, I apologize. That's just crazy camera work. I guess thrifting with two kids can be a challenge. I'm going to make excuses now. But I'm always looking for uh, cookbooks, certain like Betty Crocker type cookbooks. And, um, but I didn't see anything like that. And then most of the jewelry that, that was there was not really amazing. The video part's going to gonna end in just a second. But I didn't really see any jewelry that I wanted to pick up. And apparently I'm not going to do a very good job showing it to you either. So you cannot prove me wrong. <laughs> And say, I saw something. Obviously, it was not on purpose, though. I feel like I'm just muttering to myself. That's okay. It's paybacks for making fun of Zaheer the other night. Okay, so, um, yeah, if nothing else, we've learned that maybe we should look at those paper plate holders. And let me find the paper plate holders again. Because they seem to be selling for pretty decent money. That's not the right one either. Oh, gosh, it's just getting ridiculous. Yeah, so there's that. And then, you know, the twerking Christmas animals and Santas and things like that seem to be doing well as well. <sighs> Lesson learned. Make sure you look at everything, Margaret. Never discount stuff because you're not selling that. But anyway, okay, so that's it. I hope you found something valuable tonight. Honestly, hopefully you had a good time because I enjoyed coming on talking to you. 
and hang on. Aaron says, I'm trying to get started reselling, not having much. Love. Oh, no. Um, yeah. What kind of stuff are you picking up? Because that can, that can help. I mean, it just kind of depends. Yeah. I'm looking in the, I wonder if I can get the chat up over here so y'all can see it too. I guess you can see it after the fact. You have to look that way if you're watching later. You just got some new old stock paper plate holders still sealed. Oh, sweet. Awesome. I now I'm going to start looking at them, especially at garage sales, because that's I'm thinking I'll probably get them cheaper there. So I think that's it. I don't see any other questions coming in or anything. Um, if you are enjoying this or just was feeling a little pity for how bad this video was, go over there and give me a thumbs up. And if not, then give me a thumbs down because I totally earned it. Um, but I will see you guys on the next one. And I can guarantee you there's nowhere to go but up from here. So have a really good evening, everybody. And I'll talk to you on the next one. Bye.